Hey everyone, it's Tasia. Welcome back to my channel and to a new release video. I've been kind of quiet on the home front when it comes to new releases because of Black Friday. We've just been trying to catch up. So as the machines ran, I tried to draw out some things. And so this is what I have put together. I'm pretty excited for it. Um, the first one will get out of the way. It's a kit and um, it is the Winter Dreams kit. I did something similar in a mystery kit, but it was uh, different tones. It was more blues and things like that. So I thought I would switch it up slightly and go with a fun kind of pinky tone. So this is the first page. You have the page flags. Oh, let's do the vertical actually. Um, you have the page flags that have the little snowflakes on there. You have a cute little uh, bow bunny with the snow cap. Uh, stay cozy, hello weekend, and then a bunch of headers. And then the next page you have enough of these. I've been trying to find a happy medium when it comes to the full box lists and the decorative boxes and things like that. Um, so I did five so that way it would be maybe like every day of the week excluding weekends or something like that. So still working it out. So you have five of those and then you have this cold days warm hearts and then the world changes when it snows. A Let It Snow sticker, you have Po Panda with a little snow cap, um, Time to Recharge, a planner, and some quarter boxes. And then for the sidebar, you have your blank schedule, top priority, a fun little list of all the fun things that I like about winter. Um, you have your daily habits, a workout sticker, some TV, menu planning, another quarter box, Netflix, and then some day off and important reminder stickers. And then the next sheet, are uh, just a bunch of decorative stickers. I didn't put any layers over it because I thought you could layer nicely with another sticker or just leave it to be really decorative. I didn't want to take away from that. So that is page number four. And then page number five, you have those large strips to put along the bottom and your date covers. So that comes in regular, horizontal, and itty bitty. I'll flip through the others really quick so you can see. So itty bitty has the biggest differences. You have your mini page flags and the headers are much smaller. And then you have your little lists and then cute little ones like this. So let me do a size comparison here. So much, much smaller. This one stands just under two inches. This one stands at just about an inch. And then you have, again, your sidebar, but scaled size scaled to size <laughs> and then you have your date covers your washi strips and then your solid boxes so that is the winter dreams kit and then let's get on to all of the single sheets oh wait not single sheets yet well kind of so I made bottom washi for the January kit and I'm going to be making it for the February kit too when it comes out but these are going to be available only on the main site when you go under the vertical listing for the January kit it'll be available as an add-on you don't need to add it on per se I don't have uh, it's gonna be available for individual purchase through that listing you don't need to buy the kit to get these you can just buy the single sheet if you want but it's gonna come in a set of two because what it is is like that is the planner you know so the shorter side and the longer side I thought about making them all long and having you trim them but I hate trimming stickers and I thought you would too so I just went ahead and made it size to fit uh, so you would get these two sheets in there and then the next one which I'm sure you guys are going to be pretty excited about are that the wacky holidays so when it comes to wacky holidays for the kits for 2018 you get a ton more holidays you get like 20 something anywhere be like as many as I can fit on a page basically um, but for the single sheets we're staying with the classic design of 12 so I have been designing as far out as I can I've gotten until May um, but I'm going to work in through until June I'm gonna try and do half a year and then pump out the other half so we have January February March April and May and they're available in both regular and itty bitty so it's going to be available in the shop normally I only um, release them like two months in advance but I thought it would be kind of fun to kind of batch it out like that especially because there's still going to be special surprises in the monthly kit so wacky holidays through May going to be through June but right now it's through May uh, the next one we have Bow and Poe's mixed fitness sheet so you have 
bow and poe and some fun little well i don't think they're fun but workout stuff so you have treadmill and a barbell um dumbbells the fitness ball hydration the shoes scale little heartbeat uh let me know what you guys think if you want me to make these into single sheets like if you want all treadmills or all of these hearts or whatever it may be let me know i pulled you guys on instagram and mix sheet one by a landslide but if you want singles i can definitely do that too so right now regular and itty bitty in mixed sheet and then i started making these food serving stickers i just made these today i'm gonna try them out in my planner for next week because i'm trying to up my vegetable consumption because you're supposed to get like six servings a day or something like that and i don't get six servings a day so i'm trying hard to kind of switch that up so i made these i made some single sheets for those of you who maybe don't eat a certain thing you can buy them in these single sheets and then i have a mix sheet coming up so basically what it is so this one is fruit and then you have the little boxes to check off how many servings that you had that day so you have fruit vegetables grains do the single sheets first and protein i can make one for dairy and fats if you wanted um i know some of you if you're doing like a ketogenic diet or something like that the fat intake will be really important or just any diet really but anyways <laughs> this is the mixed serving sheet so you have protein fruits veggies dairy fats grains and nuts and seeds and so you can put one, you can put them all. I'm gonna try and layer them on the bottom of my planner. This week's plan with me is gonna show it, so we'll see how that turns out. So we have those. This is just in one size, because if you look at them, they're really slender, uh, and they're about an inch and a half in width, but I think that shouldn't be too much of a problem. If anything, you could put them on end uh, if you had to. So that's the next one, or that's that. And then we have the 2018 holidays. So this isn't all of the holidays, like when it comes to wacky holidays or it's, n this is just the holidays that are typically marked in a planner. So we have all of these here. I'm not going to go through all of them. I will just go like show them Star Wars style scanning through the screen. Um, on the side, you have the date. It's not attached to the sticker, so you don't have to worry. You're not going to have that date on there, but uh, these fit perfectly. I was testing them in my Erin Condren planner to cover up theirs because I didn't think... Uh, Oh my gosh, that's my dog harking. Um, but I, I wanted something just a little cuter, and so this worked really well. And then for those of you who maybe are using an undated planner or something like that, you'll have this available. So that's going to be in the shop. And then we have two more single sheets. Um, the first one are these little salads. I updated the salads because they used to be all in different pastel bowls, and it does, doesn't match with all of the different layouts. This one will be a little more universal. So you have it in regular and itty bitty and then for those of you i know the new year's is coming and it's kind of fun to set different goals and things like that and maybe no sugar um is one of your goals so i made little no sugar stickers and maybe you could put that as a goal accomplished or a goal set but yes that is it I felt like I rambled a lot, but that was a lot of stickers to go through. I hope you guys enjoyed the new release. I'm excited to be back in action and doing new releases again. I know it really hasn't been like that long, but I was on a really good schedule there for a minute. So anyways, again, I hope you guys liked it. If you did, definitely give this a thumbs up. And until next time, I will talk to you later. Bye.